Hi YouTube, this is your girl Sandra, aka Simply Love, and I'm in the house to do your your monthly reading for January. Happy New Year to each and every one of you, and thank you for coming to my channel. I just like to make a uh, quick announcement that I am on um, an, um excuse me, I'm sorry, <laughs> I'm on um an app called Instant Go. Uh, if you look at my community uh, section on my page, you'll see the link and everything to it. Um, it's for iOS users for right now. That means you have to have an iPhone or iPad. You always can use somebody else's if you you know really want to talk to me. It's where you get a quick question in and you know you get it right away because I'm always available on the app. So if you're on the go or you just need a quick question, you can video me, t videotape, text, uh, phone. You'll see all that when you go to my um to my uh my app the page my app page is at instant go i n s t a n t g o okay so instant go you can download download that app on your iphone or your ipad or you can just go to instago.com online and um my um my uh website uh for instant go is www.simplylove06 no, that's my website. I'm sorry. www.instantgo.com forward slash simply love. Okay, that's how you can reach me. Um, if you, you know, like I said, download the app or online and, you know, go to that, uh, to my uh, address. Follow me if you want to. If you, you know, you know, you don't have the iPhone or can't get in with an uh, iPhone or iPad, just follow me. And then when you, you know, when Android comes out this year sometimes, you'll be available and ready to talk when you want to. Okay. So now let me get on with the reading. And this is going to be for the sign of Sagittarius. Um, what I'm going to do first is read, um, intuitively that means with no cards no nothing okay here are the cards right here i have not shuffled them have not looked at them nothing here they are uh and then we're going to do bonus uh cards as well this is extended because of the new year so um let's give me a minute, moment to focus Okay, Sagittarius, what I'm seeing, I'm seeing, I'm seeing somebody going home. That's what I'm seeing. And I feel like it's an older woman. The, the energy to me is a woman. Now, it could be a man as well because, you know, we are, we are male and female species, you know, with inside of ourselves. We have both male uh, and female energies. So, But I'm feeling mostly it's a female, older woman. She's is I believe I'm, I'm seeing her being sick or him sick, you know, needing a doctor. You know, it's like somebody had to call the doctor or the ambulance or something like that at somebody's at somebody's home. So I'm feeling like yeah, this older person they they're sick and they may just be it may just be their last days if they haven't left already so you know there's no i don't say death i just say you know a passing you know is where the spirit leaves the body and they go to the everlasting life and now they're looking down at you they are angels we're all angels okay and i i'm i'm feeling like um there's a will or something like that being left some some someone's going to come from somewhere and expose a will to some of you sagittarius's so, um, that's all I'm getting right now, okay, for you guys, okay? So, let me go ahead and shuffle the card for you. This is for sun, moon, and rising signs. So, if you're not getting any messages here right now, you can, you're can. you also welcome to, to, to view your uh, sun, moon, or rising signs, okay?
Okay, we've got a bunch that fell out here. Let's see. Okay, let me get two more and I'll be ready to talk to you, Sagittarius. There it goes. See that bugger fly out? Wait a minute. Yeah, I got to get another one. This is extended, so. Here we go. All right, let's look at this story here, Sagittarius. Um... First thing I'm picking up is the Page of Wands. The Page of Wands is an Aries, Sagittarius, or Leo. So this is your energy. I feel like you're coming across to someone with a message. Or someone's coming across to you with a message. Okay? Because that's what pages do. Or we're talking about a, a children here. Something that may have to do with children. Alright? And this person is very enthusiastic. Very outgoing. If it's a child or has something to do with a child. But somebody's coming to you with a message. Okay? Three of Pentacles is, t is talking about, um, to me, in a love reading, it may be, you know, a third party situation going on. Because we got next to it the Lover's card, and the Lover's all about choices. So somebody could be in a third party situation here and has to make a choice. And the High Priestess is saying, you know, you need to use your intuition, okay? Use your intuition, Sagittarius. Because here's the person here, which is the King of Swords, Aquarius, Gemini, or Libra energy. And they're looking over at you like, you know, hmm, you know, I got it like that. You know, um, look at them. This is the, what I'm picking up. I don't care what the books or anything and all that says. I'm picking up the energy of this person not being that great, okay? They're kind of like slick and sly. You got to be careful. They're very smart, very intelligent. And they're looking over here at this high priest. It's like, you know, and this could be you or someone else that could be the side chick because they keep secrets. You know, the high priest, it could be a, a, a secret lover, and here's the lovers talking about, you know, making a choice. And here's the three of pentacles. It's third party situation. It could be happening at a job situation. So then we had the king or queen. I, tell, I meant to tell y'all is the, the, the court cards are, you know, kings or queens. Depends on who's watching the video. So I got a king or a queen of cups. Cancer, Pisces, or Scorpio, okay? And they offer love. Um, they're very intu uh, intuitive, okay? Can you see them sitting out there in the universe? That's where they like to stay in the universe, out of this world. <laughs> you know, they're, they're like on top of their game. They know what they're, they've got their stuff together. They're really straight, whoever this, per this person is, male or female. So we're looking at two people here in a third party situation and guess what's going to cost some chaos with the five of wands this is your energy you might start you know you might there might be competition or there's fighting deception all kind of things going on with them. you can see right there what they're doing it could be gossip Deception, like I said, all kind of stuff coming up with the Bible, Bible wands here, okay? Right next to the King of Cups. And then, again, there's a choice that needs to be made. Somebody need to take them blinders off their eyes and, and them two swords and put them down. It's Aquarius, Gemini, or Libra's energy, okay? That's just the energy. The lovers could be, you could be dealing with a Gemini, you could be dealing with a, a Virgo, Taurus, or Capricorn, or someone of your own sign, Capricorn, or, wait a minute, I'm sorry, Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius, Le or, or your own, someone of your own size, Aries, Sagittarius, or Leo, I'm picking up a lot of energy of that, too. Or Aquarius, Gemini, or Libra. Getting a little bit of every uh, every energy here. So somebody's in denial or somebody needs to make a decision regarding something. It's all about the, you got twos everywhere. Uh, or two or threes, you know. Three is a crowd. You, we can't, you can't do three. I mean, you. Stability. 
Stay that way if you want to for the new year. Bring in the new year with this bullshit with this threes and all this kind of stuff. Three-way uh, situations if you want to. Because all it's going to do is cause chaos, okay? And mayhem and fighting and, and, and bickering and, and people not getting along and, and having to defend yourself, okay? Either you or someone else around you is doing this. And this is a, a fire a fire energy like you. Here, this is somebody moving away. They're leaving either you or someone else because of this chaos and all this mess that's going on. Third party situations look like that's going on. They're le somebody's leaving here. It's an air energy. Aquarius, Gemini, or Libra. I don't know if I said that or not, but it is an air energy. Somebody's leaving their troubles behind. That's what I, That's what this means here. They're leaving their troubles behind. They're well aware of what's going on. So somebody's getting left behind here. Okay, Sagittarius, it could be you or someone around you. You could be doing this or somebody around you could be doing it. So what do I do next? Oh, I'm going to do my little cards here. They're shaped. I got them from Germany and they're shaped like little hearts. And I'm going to pull some out here. Whew. Here's one. There's two. Hmm. You got number 25. Let me show you the visual, Sagittarius. Uh, control and submission. Control and submission. That means that you got to release control. You see them trying to hold on to something? You got to release control issues. Uh, number 65, and let me show you the visual on that. Spiritual poverty and materialism. So somebody's suffering here. I told you, um, well, to me, it looked like it was a third party, but it's, it's got something to do with a job. And I said, you know, there's something that could be messed up there too. So you got number 36. And number 36 saying an intentional uh in intellectual relationship. So this looks like there's a you know two people that may be working together at remember I said at work? Some something's going on at a work situation. And um this spiritual poverty and materialism is like somebody's losing, maybe losing out on some money or something or gaining some money. All right. Excuse me. Now I'm going to give you some angel cards. I'm going to read you that as a bonus. Okay. And then I got to get on with my readings you guys wow you got three right off the bat fell out good you got art uh, you got angel Dan, uh, danielle okay and angel danielle says i am the angel of marriage and i am assisting you right now so if there's marital problems going on angel danielle said he's helping you with this right now okay so you have angel gabrielle Trying to get this shine off of it. And Angel Gabrielle says, You have an important life purpose involving communication and the arts. Please don't allow insecurities to hold you back. I will help you. So they're going to help you career-wise. There's something that you need to be doing. Your purpose. Your calling. That's what Archangel Gabrielle is saying. They're going to be with you as long as you pursue it. Okay. And here's Angel Chantel. Sorry for the glare, y'all. And it says, new romance is, is um, emitting either with a newcomer or through um, reunited passion in your existing relationship. Be open to giving and receiving love. So somebody's going to get some love here too, okay? Some of you Sagittarius are going to experience either a rekindle, which is somebody coming back, or it could be uh, somebody brand new. So you got to open yourself up for love. Get prepared for love. So some of y'all going through it with somebody and somebody, but there's going to be a new op uh, opportunity, okay? New opportunities coming in for love. You're going to have to get ready for it. Okay, Sagittarius, I'm using my cards. Simply loves. 
affirmation oracle cards. You are they are available for purchase. Thank you all who purchased my cards. I really appreciate it. So here's two that fell down already. And the first one says, Don't be no fool. Don't be no fool. Don't throw your life away. Don't be no fool. Don't throw your life away. That's by Loose Ends. Okay, look it up. Don't be no don't be a fool by Loose Ends. Look it up. These older songs got meaning to them. And you know what I'm saying? They got you know, these old songs help us old school people grow up. We had to grow up through just through the music. Because the music was the truth. I don't know what this music is now, but it ain't got nothing to do with no truth or nothing like that. It's got something to do with something else that ain't right. Because it's a bunch of bull. But if you go back and listen to old school music, you will it will teach you a lot. So go to YouTube and look up, you know, Don't Be No Fool by Loose Ends. And, and listen to the words. Or either just look up the, the lyrics and see what the words will tell you. Okay? Very positive. And then you got this one here, Sagittarius, and it says, I am not the object of desire to a man or a woman. I'm a subject of desire for a real man or woman. That's right. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. <laughs> Okay, with all that said, I hope you enjoyed your reading, okay? Thank you so much to my newcomers. Thank you all for sharing. Thank you all for subscribing. Thank you all who just subscribed. Don't forget to hit that little bell so you'll know when my videos come out if you like, you know, to be a part of Simply Love's uh, Love Train here, okay? Uh, we really do it up and really do it well here, okay? And I appreciate each and every one of you. I want you to have a very happy, beautiful, wonderful new year and everything is going to be brand new we just have to open ourselves up to it okay much love to you because that's all we got is love that's the only thing that's free take care bye